Good morning everyone, this is Jeannie and welcome back to my channel. It's going to be a different video today, very short. Uh, it's not a haul, not a dinner of the night, not a get ready with me, but it's a very serious video about praying and watching for the return of our Lord Jesus Christ. What I am asking everyone to do is to leave a comment below of someone you need prayer for. If you're worried about their salvation, if you know they're not saved, leave their name, not the last name. We want to protect the privacy of others. Uh, you can just say your neighbor, your friend, your, you know, whoever. And we as a community here on our channel will pray. And I want everybody who reads those comments to leave a comment that they are praying. We want to band together and pray for the salvation of our friends, our loved ones, our family, people we haven't seen in years. Anybody the Lord puts on your heart, uh, we want to pray for because you guys, we are on the cusp of the rapture of the Church of Jesus Christ with everything that's going on here on earth. We don't have much time. I don't know when. We don't know when it's going to happen, but it's going to happen. Remember that the Lord did not call us unto his wrath, and he told us to pray that we are counted worthy to escape these things upon the earth, and that's what we're doing. We pray that we are counted worthy to escape these things. How do we escape from the rapture? How do we know we will be raptured? By believing on the Lord Jesus Christ, and thou shalt be saved, nothing more. Knowing he died for you on the cross and was raised three days later victoriously with all of your sins as a sacrifice, sacrificial lamb. Now, because of all of these things happening, it is a very serious time in our lives, in the world. Um, I really feel, and this I got from J.D. Farag, I'll leave his link down below. We are born again in the day of grace. We are living in the days of grace where we just pray and ask the Lord into our heart. You're saved. You're born again. We're sealed unto redemption. The Christians who are saved during the tribulation... They are not sealed until they die and they're in heaven. That's when they are sealed, according to Revelation. So there is a difference between the day of grace and the great tribulation. The great reset, the great tribulation. Just saying. Um, so much is happening. It's very serious. We're in the last days. The rapture could come at any time. I believe in imminence. A lot of people think that it could come during the Feast of Trumpets. Um, but God is God, and he's in control, and he will name the day. And we want to be ready. Now, I'm getting this idea from Watchman River. He does this every Sunday where you just put down... The names of your loved ones or anyone you can think of and we all pray as a community for these people and that's what I want to do here so thank you for watching be ready for the rapture of the church of Jesus Christ because we are going guys if we disappear you'll know it's not aliens it's going to be the rapture so I'm not looking for views I'm not looking for more subscribers this is serious it's eternity, heaven or hell. We want those people saved. And we as a community of believers are going to rise up and pray for our loved ones. We want them saved. We want them in heaven. We don't want them to go through the great tribulation. We want them raptured with us. So that's my message. And I will talk to you in my next video. Bye, everyone.